So today I'm back with Gerald. Gerald, last time I talked to you was about four months ago, I believe, four or five months ago. Yes, sir. How have you been since then? This is like a daily struggle. You know what I mean? Uh, just, just basically homeless. Um, just going back and forth. You know, like I said. Um, it's basically about it. You know what I mean? Just trying to help my um. Trying to get to know my kids, you know what I mean? One by one. Like I said, well, I'm not stupid, you know? I know what it is already. So, uh, it, it, I'll say it in so many words, you know what I mean? So, um. How many kids do you have? You know, I have enough. Okay. I have enough. They come to me, they do come. They, they come in mysterious ways. They're all here. I know that for a fact. That's no mystery there. So. You you said you're starting to get to know them. Like, does it feel good? Nah, you know? it's like I said. Yeah, and, and, and every day feels good. I just want to stay out of prison. You know what I mean, prison is my main goal to stay out of um. I don't want to be in prison. Um, is I rather be homeless? Is I rather be homeless instead of being in prison? I'd rather sleep on the bench instead of being in a cell so many times what to do. You know what I mean? If my life's not perfect out here, it's never gonna be perfect, but it is what it is. Is I gotta ask my clinic, is I got a social security appointment, back and forth, I'd rather sleep on a bench. You know what I mean? Like I said, if people would be lying and say that life is perfect, because life ain't perfect out here. It's not at all. Nobody's life's perfect. Hey, I've been locked up my whole life, like, 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 like I said in the last interview. You know what I mean? So, if I'm doing me, I'm going to worry about me, I'm going to worry about the people homes, that I love, and, and like I said, I'm going to let's give a f- the rest. Straight up. That's basically how I've been. So, um, like I said, man, the ones who want to help me, homes, I'm going to help them, and um, that's it right there, you know what I mean? Um, Gerald, uh, how do you feel physically? Uh, you look a little thinner than last time. Nah, I'm not thinner, man. Is I'm healthy. You know what I mean? Is I'm healthy. Is I'm good. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's good that you feel good. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm thinner. I'm healthy. Hold on. You know what I mean? Like I said, like I said, she might not my back all the time, but I'm good. But, and like I said, oh, I do the right thing, I still think I want to, hey, homes, if I do the right thing, people still want to f- no reason over small shit, but homes, it's all good. I ain't sweating it. It's what it is, what it is. Gerald, uh, do you have any plans, uh, like for housing, or have you talked to the city? Yeah, or? yeah. You know, matter of fact, I do. Once I plan to get my social security, once I plan to, um, you know, is it, I'm on the waiting list for housing right now. You know what I mean? Um, and getting back in touch with my clinic. I haven't been in my clinic for about a week. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna lie. On, it, it, I've been in touch with my clinic, but like I said, man, it's my choice. Once it's not court order, or nothing like that. So, um, so I can do that. You know what I mean? So, um. That's what it is. What it is right now. Huh? I'm going to do some things right now. Some personal things, and some, and I'm going to do some difficult things. If people don't like it, huh? it is what it is. Huh? I really don't give a. F- Where do you um, think you're going to be in another six months, Gerald? Hopefully, another six months to collect my social security and um and basically like basically and basically to have my life back. You know what I mean? That's all I want. That's what I want. My life back. I don't people understand. It is a difficult life once I had, and now, and now what I've been chasing is finally, finally, finally going to come to an end. I'll just put it, I'll just put it in those words right there. It will come to an end. So, the uh, truth, the the uh, truth will set you free, and the truth will come out. So I've been chasing this truth for a long time, and um, like I said, it's coming home. It's coming because I've been. You know what I mean? I've been in prison, I've been accused of stuff I didn't do about justice system and 
it's a sad world man it's a sad world is when you live a life like this but like i said if i take responsibility for my action horns it is what it is was there uh, any trauma when you were a kid did you go through things when you were a kid that affected you as a grown-up Nah, there's abusive trauma on I me. Mean, there's abusive trauma almost all over. Um, going to CPS custody and stuff like that. Going to Florida, being in a mental health, um, like like in a mental health place. Going to counseling, seeing your parents split up. You know what I mean? There's um, there's basically stuff like that too. You know what I mean? So um, like, like I said, it's, 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 it's trauma every day, you know what I mean? It's, it's trauma that I go through every day, you know, I have to face. It's nothing new, you know, it's frustrating. It's very frustrating. Very, very frustrating. So since you're reconnecting with your kids, are they doing good? Are they doing better, your kids, your children? I see them on the street, homes. I didn't say don't talk to them, but I, but I, but, I, but what I see, homes, that I see them, they're doing good. You know, they're doing fine. You know what I mean? Like I said, man, I didn't get to know them all, homes. I don't know them all, homes. They start coming, start coming slowly by slowly. I say, homes, things work out. It is how they're supposed to work out. As long as I know who they are, and and and, and that's what matters to me, homes. They know who I am, and, and there should be no questions. That's how I look at it. Either I love my kids to death, homes, or I'll do anything for my kids, you know what I mean? Um, like I said, hopefully one day we will get to meet and we can do a lot of stuff together, homes, make up time, whatever they want to do, you know what I mean? They're um, grown adults now, so um, like I said, man, some of them, most of them, most of them have very good mothers, so um, like I said, homes, they'll be, um, it's going to be challenging, but homes, they'll be, it'll, it'll be worth the challenge. Just put it that way. It, it will be worth the challenge. I like it. Sim it's something to wake up to. It's something. It, 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 if I didn't know about these kids, do I didn't know something? I wouldn't care. You know what I mean? I'd rather be back in prison. Like I said, it, 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 my life's not perfect, but is I wake up for them every day. Only I wake up to breathe. So. Like I said, Schmanson, like I said, Schmanson, it, it's basically hard, I mean, it, it's hard. How do you overcome the challenges of every day, Gerald? Like uh, food and something to drink and somewhere to sleep. Avoiding all the drama and conflict out here. How do you do it? Man, I walk away. I, I learn to walk away. That's it. Just walk away from things and what, like I said, once I never walk away from them. So, it's what it is, what it is. Can you imagine uh, seeing kids that are your, your uh, children's age out here, like young people? Yeah. Doing these blues and stuff. Like, what what advice would you have for those young people, hey, Gerald? Little, like I said, it, it's it, it basically for those young people who the best advice I got, like I said, I was, it, it don't be like me, you know what I mean? You don't want to be locked up, um, you don't want to end up in prison, um, it's not worth it. When you pick up that pill, when you know the choice, when you pick up this, it, it, you know the consequences, the people making excuses and um, try to blame this and this. It, like, 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 like I said, man, it's all up to us, you know what I mean? It's our actions. It, 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 if I choose to pick up this, if I choose to do this, if I choose to do this, then there's an action to it. Smash, smash, smash. Like I said, I basically know that shit, man. I'm a grown ass man. So, you know. It's yeah. frustrating. It's very, very frustrating. But, like I said, I will, I will get through it. I guarantee that. I walk away from a lot of stuff every day. Like I said, well, I'm not perfect, but I walk away from a lot of stuff. And like I said, I'd rather be by myself and look, you know what I mean? I look towards the future, you know what I mean? I just mean, change. Gerald, I asked you uh, if you remember Shorty. Uh, Shorty remembers you. Uh, she saw your video and she said, oh, that, that's Gerald, I, I remember him. Uh, she knew you, she knew you when you were younger. 
and uh, you, I showed yeah. you a picture of her, her video that I did with her recently, and you recognized her, right? So yeah, yeah. So uh, I do. Yeah. So she just wanted me to say hi to you and uh, right. to keep your head up and keep fighting, okay? All right. So in the meantime, I'm gonna say uh, thank you very much, Gerald. I appreciate you talking to me. Please continue to fight and stay strong oh, keep your always. head up and uh and stay safe out here okay all right we'll talk soon all right